Hi everyone, it's me, Trina. How are you today? I just finished my evening bath and I don't have my teeth in, so please bear with me. Um, tonight I want to talk a little bit about a little more than just teeth. I don't know about everyone else. Sorry, I'm trying to adjust this. I have health problems. Um, I was diagnosed with cancer, and I had a mastectomy, and it came back after a five-year clean bill. So I had two more surgeries, and uh, I seen a doctor a couple of days ago. And he seems to think at the last surgery that a cell of cancer may have gotten cut and it could have went through my blood. This is not certain, so let's pray that's not the case. If it is, it is what it is. But they're afraid it might have went to my brain. So, teeth and mindset... I really feel like they go hand in hand, and our health plays a big part as well. I'd like to see everyone to do the best and be the best that they can in life. Um, I did do the work on my denture today. I think I've got it about where I want it. I live way out in the country, thank you Lord, because I love it here, um, <laughs> I just hadn't got out to the store, us country folks, we don't just run right out to the store, we take our time about it, so, um, when I do my next soft rewind, which is, I hope tomorrow, I'm not going to promise you, but I really hope tomorrow, but I want to do it where you guys can watch. Um, so, because it's kind of a, and maybe if I'm doing something wrong and someone out there sees what I'm doing and says, hey, that's what's her problem, please drop me a comment down there in that little comment thing, please, and thank you. Um, I, I'd like to know, am I the only person that my health seems to affect me with the dentures? Um, I'm, a, I'm really a kind of private person, so for me to be making this videos, it, I think it's helping me, <laughs> so thanks to all of you that are watching, I really appreciate it. You don't know how much you're helping me. Um, for those of you that have been doing this denture thing, maybe that know of something that I might need to try, I heard something about a, I believe it was considered a hardliner, I'm not familiar, I'm not real sure what that is. But I would love, like, if someone could drop in the comments, um, share with me how your health or even uh, financial makes it so hard on dentures. I believe this is something that we need to get out there for people that maybe don't have the help they need and... Heck, who knows? We may could change the world and help some people that need help. And that would be wonderful. Um, on that note, I also... I have one brother. Um, he is 60 years old. And other than him, I only have a handful of aunts and uncles. And don't get to see them a lot, but I love every one of them. But man, I really have some wonderful friends in my life. 
Um, I haven't been the friend that I should be. And I think these videos are helping me to realize that it's important to let, let the people in our lives know that we care. It's so easy to, to get disgusted or depressed or even aggravated at simple things that when we sit back and look at it, none of that really matters. What matters is we're alive and we're well. Um, I would like some comments on things that you all would like to talk about, what you would like to hear about. Um, out here in the country, we have a horse. Her name is Brandy. And I'm sure I'm probably going to get, <coughs> excuse me, a few ugly comment comments on this. But she's really old and her owner, my sister-in-law, passed away with an aneurysm. And I feed Brandy honey buns. <laughs> she really loves honey buns. So that's her treat. And um, little things in life that are that simple that can bring joy to us is priceless. Now, like I said, tomorrow I do intend it may be tomorrow evening. And also, on the last video I done, and I said I'm going to pause it, I have no idea to how to pause this thing and get it started back up. So, sorry, I did not mean to lie to y'all. Um, it was an accident. Sorry, I was checking on my baby here. Bama, say hi. Say hello. Say hi. That's Bama. She is my best friend. Um... I also was diagnosed with uh, bad cholesterol, and I have a port cast in my chest here. It how do you say it protrudes from the skin, and it's something that they had given me chemotherapy through. And at that time, I had a really healthy heart, and so. Now I'm kind of confused because um, my heart's not the best in the world at the moment. And the reason they think I may have brain cancer or something is my body is shocking all over. I feel like I'm plugged into an outlet. And... It's almost as if electricity goes through my body. I'm not resting. I've been given medicine and it's it works a little, but it's not doing the trick. If anybody knows anything about what that could be, please drop comments in. Um, as I was telling you about my brother Ricky... I want to do a segment on him, and it'll probably be a while, that he is a fan of the band KISS and Gene Simmons, and he has bought what they call a vault. Now, I'm sorry, I, I'm a music lover, I have no idea what these vaults are, but, uh, when he opens it, um, I'd like for y'all to see what he's got. He's really proud of it, and he's really a, he's a good old timer, I think. And he's getting his dentures too, so <laughs> maybe he can put some insight on that. But I just wanted to touch base with everyone and 
let you guys know I'm not a quitter. I'm not going to give up on this thing. And sorry about not having my teeth in. I got them in there soaking. I, when I put them in this time, I'm hoping that the only time you'll see me without, well, you, I don't, I hope you don't see me without them anymore. That's the goal. So, and also, I'm considering possibly using a, two of the soft relines in my tops and maybe one and a half in my bottom because these are the um, immediate dentures and due to my illnesses I'm not sure if I'll be able to get my permanents so I'm trying to turn these into permanents so um, if you guys could just let me know what you think about the uh, using two on the top and one and a half on the bottom and if anyone out here knows anything about the hard line or anything that I could do also to help get my teeth to where I can tolerate them all the time please write down whoops write down in the comments please don't hesitate I hope everybody's having a really great evening out there and put a picture in the comment or a, a video down there and if you're having problems if your teeth are loose drop a video and let's all work together and let's let's fix things some of us can't afford those dentists but buddy I'll tell you what we sure can't afford to be friends and look out for one another so until tomorrow I love you guys and have a great evening tell them bye bam say bye bye tell them bye bye you're not gonna say bye She's a little sleepy. Y'all have a great evening.